y'all welcome back to the channel if you're new to the channel welcome 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 my name is Sonia and I do a lot of uh, cleaning videos and I also do cooking vlogs as well as regular vlogs so with that being said today's video I will be showing you some of my cooking things as you know I do, do dabble sometime in my health journey so this video today is really much of my health journey so right now I just got back from taking my walk um, yeah, exercising. I just did a walk for today. Don't mind the hair. It's about to come out. I can't take it no more with that. That's irrelevant. But anyway, but before I get started showing you what I'm going to be making today, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. I would love for you to join the family. Don't forget everyone to like, comment, subscribe, and share these videos with everyone. Please comment down below to let me know what you would like to see on this channel because that will help me to keep this channel growing. Not only that, to keep you engaged as well. I don't want you guys to just click on the video, you know, and just say, uh, this don't interest me or whatever, whatever. What do I need to change or what can I improve in these video? I would love to hear from you guys because I love you guys. And not only that, you are my greatest, greatest supporters. So I need you to comment down below. A lot of you do comment and a lot of you do DM me on my Instagram sometimes. Um, I love that, but please, if you can, just comment down below on the YouTube channel, and that will help me to determine um, what you would like to see on this channel to keep it going, okay? So with that being said, today, let me show you what I'm going to be making. I got it soaking because it was still kind of cold. So I'm going to be making just simple meal tonight. Is whiting, baked whiting, also with string beans. Um, I am going to put the potatoes in it, but I'm not going to drink, I mean, eat the potatoes. But I'm just going to put it in with a little bit of flavoring in there and onions. I'll just show you how I do it. But first, I'm going to clean the uh, fish off and season it and let it marinate for a little bit. Because I have to leave out and I have to go, where are we going to? Target? Yeah. Yeah, I have to go to Target for some essential items, so... But then I'll come back and start to cook it to show you. But my main seasoning that I always use is just regular onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, um, obey seasoning. And I may either, no, I'm not going to do the lemon pepper seasoning. I'll just put those on on Mrs. Dasher's seasoning. So I'm going to put that on and I'm going to put a little bit of uh, butter on it. And or maybe a little bit of olive oil, whichever one. I'm not sure yet, but I'll let you guys know with the lemon and stuff. Reason why I'm doing that, because I'm trying to get back down. I cannot keep telling you guys, you know, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, and then I don't follow through either. So I just want to encourage you on today, if you are trying to lose weight or trying to get healthy, and it seems like it's a roller coaster, you keep going up and down, some of you may reach the goal, but I know with me, I'm going to be transparent. I don't always get it right. I don't always stick to it. But I do go up and down, up and down like that. So with that being said, I'm going to try now. I've been trying lately now because I have been um, changing my eating habits. And one of the ways that I stop eating, I'm going down to low carbs. And I'm trading out my junk food for a lot of vegetables and fruits and stuff. So now that I was told by the nutritionist, you know, you got to be careful with a whole lot of fruit, but that's still better than eating, you know, the uh, potato chips, the Twizzlers. These are the things I have. The ice cream. I'm not depriving myself of those. But I noticed that when I let go of the Twizzlers and different things like that, I tried to eat it the other day. It was so, so sweet. I could not even finish. I had to give it away. So at least I know that part is gone. And one of the things I'm working on is my mental health, you know, the mental health. Because... It is hard. I'm not going to lie to you. It is very, very hard. And I did want to get the surgery. I'm knocking, knocking nobody for the surgery to help with that. But my doctor would not allow me to do it, she said, because I know she knows that I can lose the weight. So she's holding me accountable. <laughs> my big brother, if you're watching this, because he's always watching my channel, Ray, Dennis Ray. If you're watching this, you're holding me accountable. My sister Vicky is holding me accountable. And long as my children as well and my husband. So especially my grandson. Oh Lord, he challenged me in everything. But anyway, there if you can find someone that can hold you accountable, but you have to, you know, 
hold yourself accountable as well because that's what's going to work and don't beat yourself up don't keep getting on a scale everything so i found an outfit that i used to wear a dress and it was <laughs> size 14 so i said i'm gonna use that for motivation i put the dress on and it wouldn't even go past my thighs i mean it literally stopped right there so that's going to be my go-to to see how much inches i lose not so much of the weight but how many inches because i know even when i hit that 196 um i still look like i was a little bigger because i'm big boned so with that being said you know it's okay as long as i'm feeling better and breathing better that's what works for me so again i am on this mission back with my journey again like i said i've been walking more um just mainly focusing on my eating i got my journal back so i can write down each meal what i eat for breakfast what i eat for snack what i eat for lunch what i eat for snack what i eat for dinner and what i eat for snacks because that's how you're supposed to eat but you're supposed to do it in small portion if you want to see how that go i do have previous video showing you how to calculate your calories count your calories if that's what you want to do or count your carbohydrates whichever way you want to do it i had that all in my previous video that's why i went back and i started looking at those things to see how can i get back on track and what i was doing before that works because what i was doing lately is not working so with that being said i don't want to hold you that long on this this is going to be a very short video so I'm going to go ahead and clean and season my um, fish up, let it marinate, and then I will show you guys how everything turned out. And again, please don't forget to hit that like button and give me some suggestion, ideas, what you would like for me to cook on this channel. Um, recreate some of the vi uh, foods that I used to do. They were all good. So you can go back and check on all of my used to do Dr. Sebi's meal, you know, all those things. And I want to get back into it, but I got to see, you know, what you guys like. And the only way I can tell by seeing the views, how they're going up. So if my views go up, that means that you're enjoying these videos. So if my views go down, that means that I'm not reaching you. So let me know what you would like to see on this channel. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So here's the seasons that I'll be using. Like I said, Mrs. Dash garlic powder, onion powder, Old Bay season, a little bit of smoked paprika. I'm just gonna season this up really quick. I don't use um, salt or anything like this because a lot of these already have salt ingredient in it. So I don't wanna overdo it with it. So I just, I don't know if you guys can see it. Yeah, you can see it. I do go heavy on onion powder and stuff like that though. So we're just going to let this sim um, sit for a little bit, marinate a little while, and then we'll go back and check it out. But I am going to go in with a little bit of my 
olive garlic and flavor herbs. Then we're just going to cover it up and I'm going to come back to it later. Our string beans.
right, y'all. The string bean is done. I don't like it in a lot of water. These are the petite. string rings with the potatoes. dinner hope that you guys enjoyed it what you see on that top is just a dressing that i put on top of the fish so here we have petite string beans with some baked whites all right hope that you guys like this enjoyed the video give me a thumbs up um see you on the next video